back here again at Jamaica Farms. Mm. Everything that Jamaicans like, we grow here. Come on over, let me show you. You don't know, you know? I'm a lady on the first day of the reggae dance hall, and I bring to you and you and you. What we say? Jamaica from the outside. Eh, eh. A Jamaica from the outside. And I'm proud me proud to be a Jamaica. But we say all of we barriers, them are broke down. All of we barriers, them are broke down. We are one united Jamaica. It's again a bit of spice of the soul. Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm here on Jamaica Farms with Mr. Miller. And yes. this is the moment you've all been waiting for, guys. Let's Long hear. Time. Yes. <laughs> Let's hear from Mr. Miller. Mr. Yes. Miller, how are you? Doing great. Doing great. Good. The viewers nice. are excited and wanting to hear what's happening with the mangoes. Yes. Well, the mangoes are coming in. Most of them are, I'd say, from green coming on to turn they're not exactly ready yet we don't have that many as many as we were expecting the trees are very young but mangoes are looking good this little tree right here I have a 24 mango on it and it's just a year over a year old well, persons are wanting to know if they can get mangoes I'm sure that's the question they want to um, no. We don't have enough mangoes for everybody. Right now what we're doing is limiting how much so a person can get up to maybe five pounds of mango. That's about five the pounds. maximum. Okay. We just don't have enough. Yes. Trees, yeah, it, it's just not enough mangoes this year. So it's first come, first serve. <laughs> kind of, yes. Okay. Yes. All right. More mango over there. All those came off the trees. That is just gonna handle it. And Sometimes look at this tree right here. You can't hardly see it, but if you go like this, come on, look on it here. Look at peppers. Look under there. And we just picked over what 300 pounds of pepper. Wow. And give it another week, and when it's time to pick again. And we have good East India mangoes this entire row. So you'll find mango, a few on each tree that we, we did not remove. Some of them start to turn, you know, and rise. Some of the trees, when the wind come, because they are so small and the mangoes mm -hmm. are so heavy, break the tree. Yes. So we take them off so that the tree will grow and get stronger. Stronger. Mm -hmm. so look, at, look at this, how beautiful this is. That means lots of mango for next uh, season. Them full, you know, but so uh, they can actually be picked and put down. Mm -hmm. So this entire row is just East India. Can go? Okay. Yeah, this row is East India. Over there is Julie. Ah, oh. oh, this one full too. Yeah, that means that they soon ripe up and we. Uh -huh. Okay, we're gonna look at pepper. Yes. And those and the, those reap like three days ago. Uh, look, just look at this tree. This tree will reap three days ago. Uh -huh. A lot of red pepper. I was there just trying to see if the one on the tree and that one just came off in my hand. I don't, but we'd have to walk through. Okay. Back here again at Jamaica Farms. Mm. Everything that Jamaicans like. We grow here. Come on over, let me show you. Star apple. And these are already 
Black so they, so they, they, they keep their star up for by next year. And here we have um, our little set of custard apples. We have 400 plants right here. Come back my a lot of people like these green. They normally want to buy it just like that. These are Julie. Actually super Julie. Look at the size of them. Alright, can I be These are huge. Yeah. I won't leave for them like that. I've been doing it day in, day out. Yeah, you have to um, switch tight up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. All you need, man, good food. All you need, man. Look at that big one. Boy. Harvest moon. I think that's what this is. Look at the size. We have some down the bottom there, big like coconut. So Bernadians selling no green mango today? Green? Yeah, the green ones. I, I just cook the green ones and make um, uh, mango and char and chat and kuchula and stuff like that. So I need some I green ones. I don't know if it is worth it. Mm -hmm. Because they sell for five dollars a pound, so people don't really normally buy it for cooking. Oh, yeah. So we have some more down there, right? so we can go across and see if we find any more. Cause those have mangoes mm -hmm. on them, but they are not ripe. Okay. Those are not that my. Huh? Those are not that my free premium mango, so they don't normally cook them. Oh, we just do that. Oh, yeah. With the with those type of mango, mm -hmm. we do anything with any kind of mango. Okay, it doesn't matter what brand or what breed right. it is. What country? Trinidad. 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 Yeah. We, okay. We, we do a lot of things with mangoes. Okay. You know? Okay. Oh, look, hey, look at that. Even at so we have a guest today who is looking for the green mangoes Definitely. to cook. Raphael Nanku from Jacob Settlement, Santa Flora, Trinidad and Tobago, West Indies, here by Bernard Farm in Orange. Fort Piers, we're here to get some nice scotch bonnet peppers, which is wonderful and healthy and nice. I hope when I get home, it, it could burn me enough. Because <laughs> I want it real hot. Yes. You understand what I'm saying? Okay. So we're here at Bernard Farm, enjoying the view with all the different products and stuff. Wonderful. Mr. Miller will say to you, it's Jamaica Farms. Jamaica yeah. Farms. Yeah. There you go. Yes. There we go. Trinidad in the house, guys. Trinidad, Trinidad in the house. In the house. Okay. Yes. Live and direct. All right. You want us to look at the others down there and sure. go? Sure. Alright, so follow. Here we have uh, Vina. Oh, look at these. Ooh. These look succulent. Oh, there they are. These are Venus. They get huge. <sighs> wow. Wow, guys, look at these. Venus. Wow. Those are long This is a Bombay. Wow. A Bombay mango here in Florida. Wow. Bombay. Bombay. Only a few on the tree. 
But we are lucky to get some, but I think next, yes. year, next year it's going to do better. It's going to do well. Look at this here, food punch. Ooh. Gosh. Food punch. Wow. Well, that's a food punch. And let's see what we have. Oh, Naseberry. Look at that. This is going to have produced a lot. Every yeah. tip is Look. full of Naseberry. Every tip full. Wow. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, let's okay. go off. <laughs> Every limb is almost touching the ground because of the weight of the mango. That, that lady, also, she also got it. have that, yeah. That one, that one. Tommy? Yep, that's a Tommy actually. Oh. Oh, Phoenix. I love yeah. that mango. It has a very unique flavor. The grass grew about two inches per night. So we're just breaking for a minute here to try a mango. To tell the truth, I'm always in the mood for mangoes. Oh. Just look at this. What that this one like. is a Bombay. Mm -hmm. That Bombay? Mm -hmm. Whoa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you just told me it was <laughs> I want to see what this tastes like. I've never tried this mango. I like this. Mm -hmm. I like this. this. Very unique. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. We just found one rosy gold ready to be picked. Wow, is it this, ripe? Yes. Okay. And this is one of the first mangoes you get for the season rose gold Love yes it. wow okay wow okay remember the last time you guys saw a custard apple alley all the way small no yes let's see if we can take it through the alley again here we go we have uh, blossom and just about and every plant and all the blossom and look at the fruit up down here and there we go fruits Big ones over there. See them down here? Look, four of them right under here. Wow. Is it a four of them? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. There might be more. And that's the thing about custard apple. You just stumble up on them. Look at that. Rows and rows of custard apple. 
Don't put it up to start for the Akimoyas. Yes. I feel like I've been walking a mile in this custard apple. You finish with the sugar apple already? Yes. You finish with the sweet apple already? Oh yes. And you get it. There are cups, sweet apple. Sugar apple. Sugar apple, yeah. That's the new most right thing. Sugar apple. Sugar apple, yeah. That's the new most right thing. Sugar apple. We call it sweet sweet. Jamaicans call it sweet sap. When they start to separate, it's when it's pork now. Yeah. It start to get. <laughs> okay. I'm looking to see if this one is cute. Yes. And this is more plant and now, trees. If you want to make dukuno or blue dress, look at the leaves or the African. Plantains and bananas are also available. Green bananas as well as ripe bananas. And of course, mangoes, everyone's favorite. But you can smell the East Indian in it. You see, it tastes perfect.